Hey everyone, Mike Mulligan here. Thank you so much for joining me today. I am a certified orientation and mobility specialist. And in today's video, I wanna demonstrate a technique called Heinz Break as a way of refusing unsolicited physical assistance. All right, let's do this. So the technique I'll be demonstrating today is called Heinz Break. Uh, fun fact for you, this is the only O&M technique that's actually named after a person. Uh, but anyways, this is a very useful technique for refusing unsolicited physical assistance. Unfortunately, many well-meaning sighted people who are trying to help someone who's blind or vision impaired will just physically grab the person without asking and try and pull or drag them uh, to a destination or even across the street. And this really should not happen. The last thing anybody wants is to be touched without somebody asking. But unfortunately, uh, this happens quite a bit. I've heard uh, many stories and it actually kind of makes me angry uh, that people think they can just grab onto somebody and pull and move them uh, without being asked. So if anybody ever tries to grab you without asking or without you wanting them to grab you, uh, you can use this technique I'm about to demonstrate called Heinz Break. Uh, this is really important because uh, your safety is important and you should feel comfortable uh, when going around and traveling and you shouldn't be worried about people grabbing you, but it might happen. So if somebody does grab you, uh, it's really important to practice this technique and really uh, spend some time learning it. Uh, that way you'll feel a little safer if this situation unfortunately would or does happen to you. All right, so let's start the demonstration. Okay, now I'm going to start my demonstration here how to do the Heinz break technique. I have some help from my nephew here. And he's going to demonstrate what it looks like when someone who is sighted is trying to help someone who's blind. And for this example, I'm going to be the person who's blind and he's going to grab onto me like he wants to pull me across a street. So this actually happens. People are waiting across the street. A uh, well-meaning pedestrian just grabs onto the person when the light's green uh, to pull them across. Uh, but you don't necessarily want that. So. I'm gonna have uh, my nephew here grab onto me and like he's pulling me. So right now he grabbed onto my right arm with his left arm, he's standing on my right side. So for the Heinz break technique, the first thing you wanna do is make sure your feet are planted in the ground. So you got a solid base and then you're gonna bring your arm, the one that the person grabbed, across your body diagonally like this. And hopefully with that movement, the person will let go. Uh, not necessarily, and I'll show you what to do if they don't in just a second, but once you pull, so David, if you grab me again, pull across, he lets go, and then you can say something like, uh, thank you, I don't need assistance right now, or I prefer to have assistance by me grabbing you. So that gives you some options because you really want to be in control. So now I'm going to give you an example of what to do if the person does not let go after you do your arm diagonally across your body. So he grabs on diagonally, still holding on. So then you're gonna use your opposite hand. So now I'm using my left hand, he's holding on to my right, to grab his wrist, the one that's holding my arm, and pull it off me, because you don't want him grabbing onto you. So you pull him off, and then again, like I said before, you can say, uh, thank you, I don't need any assistance, or uh, thank you, I'd prefer if you guide me with me grabbing onto you, uh, like this. So I'm grabbing now onto uh, David here. So that's really the basics of Heinz Break. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope this video was helpful in learning the Heinz Break Maneuver to refuse unsolicited physical assistance. Uh, please, if you're not feeling comfortable doing this, uh, please, if you can, meet with an orientation and mobility specialist who can help practice this with you to make sure you're doing it properly. Uh, I know this isn't the easiest technique to do and it's kind of an uncomfortable situation, but it's really important. And thank you so much. And please, if you're feeling up for it, subscribe to my channel and click that little bell icon to be alerted when new videos become available. Have a wonderful day.